Hi, I'm Chelsea, the Christian nutritionist. There's a passage in Ephesians when St. Paul says, no one ever hates his own body, but feeds it and takes care of it, just like Christ does for the church. And my first thought when I read that was, bull honky. There's a ton of people who hate their body and don't feed it or take care of it well. I used to hate my body for all of those years that I battled a genetic skin condition. I felt like it was against me when really it was doing exactly what God designed it to do. Push toxins out through my largest detoxification organ, my skin. But I didn't know that at the time. I thought my body was just being difficult. And it's hard to have a healthy relationship with something or someone that you think is against you. It doesn't really make you want to be nice. <laughs> and there are so many of us that are not nice to our body. We think and say mean things about it. We drive it into the ground with insane schedules. We put fast food and fake ingredients in it and we don't take time for rest. And when we do try to approach weight loss or medical intervention, it's like we do it with our dukes up, you know, like we're going in to conquer an enemy. And does that sound like a healthy relationship to you? In this passage, Paul is comparing the way we treat our bodies to the way a husband should treat his wife and the way Christ treats the church. It's about relationship and relationships go so much better when there is love, respect, and appreciation. You can't dish your body and expect positive change. Appreciate it for the amazing creation that it is. Give it respect by caring for it well and love it for taking you through this amazing gift of life. I hope you enjoyed this sermon on the couch. Have a healthy and blessed week.